Hi, my name is Craig Gordon. I run the Need Foundation, Nutrition and Exercise versus Addiction and Disease. Today I'd like to talk about the economics of poor nutrition, malnutrition, or what now the UN calls undernutrition. But today I'm talking about just America. So 75% of all healthcare dollars, which is around 2.6 or 7 trillion dollars in America, is literally wasted on preventable disease. Could you only imagine what we could do with even half of that money, say 1.5 trillion dollars, focused on all sorts of positive programs, rebuilding America, rebuilding our health care system and making it functional and effective. Do you think it's okay for your family and the U.S. government to subsidize your bad habits? I don't think so. How selfish is that? How self-serving? How close-minded or shallow-minded is it to think it's okay for everybody else to pay for our bad habits? Are we complicit or complacent? Do we just look the other way? Are we making decisions based on economics? but don't care about the repercussions because we make money? Maybe. Maybe that's a sick part of society that needs to change. We need to bump our ethics and respect for others way up and maybe make a little less money, but do it without hurting other people. How much do you think malnutrition is costing America one, three, five, seven trillion dollars a year? Could you only imagine what a trillion dollars of extra money in this country and what we could do with those resources to address some of the myriad of problems that we face? Problems, challenges, issues, and things that are so out of place, so screwed up, and so ass backwards, you couldn't even begin to imagine. And if we had the resources to redeploy toward positive, healthy outcomes and programs, amazing. So what do you think? One, three, five, or seven trillion a year. I would have to say it's at least $5 trillion of wasted money a year. A quote by Winston Churchill and Albert Einstein said something similar. He's not concerned about the action, but the inaction. I read long ago about a term called passive inaction where people are so stuck and so unwilling to get involved in the process or the debate or take any of their very precious time, energy, and money and do anything positive, it's hard to imagine. But I know our grandparents and our great-grandparents and our descendants made a lot of sacrifices for us to have freedom and what do we do with our freedom now? What are our kids and grandkids looking at? And we think we can sit on our laurels and buy a new house in Florida and plan our next vacation and do this, that, and the other thing. Anything but get involved. So maybe we need to think about that. How about if we got half of America healthy 
in the next five to seven years. No cherry picking, half right down the middle. So I'm not saying everybody, I'm saying half. I'm trying to be reasonable. And what would that mean? That means that we could save a trillion dollars on health care, maybe more. That means we could make another trillion dollars, or maybe two, on productivity in America. That means we could plug the gaps and the leaks of money having to do with health care, or what I call sickness care. And you just couldn't imagine how this might actually straighten out not only the lack of resources, but pay off the national debt in 10 to 12 years. There is actually a viable, common sense plan to pay off the national debt. And what would that mean to our grandkids and their kids? How about we all take some responsibility and get serious about getting that done? So what is public enemy number one? Nutritional illiteracy. Please start to learn about nutrition. Apply it to yourself. Get in better condition mentally and physically. And share this with your family and be a great example. My name is Craig Gordon. I represent the Need Foundation. We obviously have lots of signage and PSAs. We have books. We have measurable prevention workbooks. We have children's books. We have all sorts of different types of material to augment and all sorts of original content to share on all these different things. And the economics of malnutrition in America are unbelievably costly. And we can change the whole picture by getting America healthy. My name is Craig Gordon, needusa.org. Thank you, and take care of your body. Good luck.